YouTube, this is The Bucket coming at you today with my range review on the Siley Cat X Pro. This is a multi-reticle system red dot, which means it has a 3 MOA dot, a 30 MOA circle, and then you can also add the circle and the dot. So I'll see if I can get it to come up on the camera. All you do is you hold this up arrow, and then it switches from the dot to the circle to the circle with the dot. It's really, really nice. It, it's got eight brightness settings. It's got two night vision settings. You'll see that there's a door right here, so you never have to re-zero the dot just to change out the battery. What makes this one different from the, uh, from the regular Pro is they made the glass a little bit thicker. It's still IPX7 waterproof. The window is 0.83 inches by 0.65 inches. So these micro dot windows, they're not the biggest because the dot is on a really small gun so uh but it was really really easy so when you get your box you've got your regular siley box it's going to come with the rag it comes with a little sticker i love the instructions where it explains to you how to change the dot how to look at it it's really nice it also gives you zeroing instructions i talk about this every time i open up a Siley. I love the fact that it helps out people that may have never zeroed a dot. It gives you lots of instructions on how to do that. I love that they make it super, super easy. It comes with a couple of tools and then it also comes with all the screws that you'd need to do a bunch of different mounting. So for me, it was super easy. I removed two screws off of the plate off the back of my gun and then I put some Loctite and then I screwed these back down to 15 um, on my torque driver and I was installed and ready to go. So I like using my Fiaki green bore sight, which is really neat. You can pick these up for like eight or 15 bucks on Amazon. I like doing a different color. So one of the downsides of the X Pro for the cat is currently they just have it in red dot. I would prefer green dot. So I use my green laser with my red dot. It makes it really pretty easy to uh, zero this at home. And then it really cuts down on the amount of rounds that you have to put on target when you're out at the range. Uh, I like the way it fits. It's a little bit wider than the slide, but not much at all. My CYA holster still locks up good and tight. It would be easy to conceal this. This is just a really good dot. Now, they're not inexpensive because, again, you've got the ape lock protection. You've got shake and wake technology that's got a 50,000 hour battery life. It is a multi reticle system dot. You know, it really checks a lot of those boxes and it's got aircraft aluminum steel, uh, sorry, aircraft aluminum on the housing, so it's going to hold up. Now, it is not a closed emitter red dot, and that's why it runs. On their website right now, it's showing that this is 235. If you go to Amazon, it looks like they're trying to get 250 for them. So they're not cheap, but uh, with the amount of features that you get, you wouldn't necessarily want cheap. So it's really easy to pick up. I love the fact that they had MOA adjustment on the elevation and on the windage. I think it took us 20 bullets to get this zeroed and to get the kind of accuracy that we were wanting to get. Now, if you want to know about how the GX4 performs, you can go ahead and check out my review just on the GX4. But to give you a little bit of an idea, when I took out the GX4 with irons, this is at 7 yards. I had four shots that were within this 2, 2.5 inch circle. So that's pretty good. Now, after I put the red dot on, this is the kind of accuracy I got. So you can kind of compare the two right there. That's four shots right there on the bullseye. And that one's still actually hitting the two and a half inch circle, but it's just a little bit off. And that was me. That wasn't the gun. I felt that one go a little bit errant. So I'll be honest with you. When you're looking and saying to yourself, I want a micro compact package, the GX4 is just a great option. To think that you can get a CYA holster and then you can throw a high quality Siley Cat X Pro red dot on there and get that kind of accuracy. We put 200 and 
two, 250 rounds through this gun. It held zero. It was really, really easy to pick up. It was just a great red dot. So if you're thinking about any micro compact pistol that you might want to throw a red dot on, the Siley Cat X Pro is a great option, helps with accuracy, and I think you're really going to enjoy it. So I really do want to thank you guys so much for supporting the channel. All the likes, the comments, the shares, they're really appreciated. And as always, you stay classy, YouTube. Little middle baby bucket. Do you want to live in California? No. Why? Because I'm not a communist.